we believe that participation-based AI is the way of the future. We heard NTU for the launch of the decentralized AI research hub between NTU Singapore and Zero Gravity. So let's go. Centralized AI is what we know. It's more common and you know, prevalent out there. So why is decentralization the necessary next step? And what real problems does it solve that centralized AI can't? We call centralized AI black box AI because fundamentally you don't know where the data came from, who labeled the data, what the weights and biases of the model are, what version of the model you're getting, how the model is behaving. You're trusting a single entity, somebody like OpenAI, to basically tell you everything's running according to plan. And so that's where decentralization comes in. It creates AI that's transparent, that's verifiable, and as a result, safe. Decentralization means that there's many owners of that system. And so it's not just one entity that controls the entire ledger, because then it's not decentralized by definition. And so on our system, we'll have many different types of validators. Because the ledger is public, anybody can go onto an explorer and actually look at all the transaction history that happened. Because it's black box, nobody can see it besides the people that are training the model. But if you have a completely open model, like in, in our case, then we will see these kind of nefarious uh, issues happen before they actually arise. We believe that participation-based AI is the way of the future. Singapore is the right place to do it because Singapore is already ahead of the curve anyways. There's really deep investments made into AI here. There's a whole scheme around an overseas path and attracting AI uh, entrepreneurs. And so we see Singapore as a leader. And that's why we're super excited about NTU and the Zero-G collaboration in this research center. But this is the first because we see Singapore as the right hub for um, building decentralized AI technology. Thank you.